Hi there, it's Ben at Matter Solutions. I'm just going to do a quick connect of Google Search Console to a new website. So first and foremost, we've got a WordPress site over here on the left. I'm logged in. I'm an admin. They have the Yoast plugin installed. I'm going to click here and have a look at the settings just to check it's not already integrated. This is the easiest way to do this by far. So you can just search for Google. Site connections, Google, there it is, add verification code. So here we are on the right hand side, Google Search Console. And what we're going to do is we're going to copy the domain name. I'm just going to add the www version, which is the one that's live and has been live. And it's HTTPS, continue. Now it's going to try based on what settings I've already got and what it knows about me. And it's going to fail because I don't have any Google Analytics or Google Tag Manager with this website in mind. But here, I could upload a file. Well, I don't have a file manager, but I could add a tag. So here we go. Let's copy this tag. Put that in there. If I paste, it strips it. Save changes. And we might want to check the front end. So that's saved. And then I can view the source to do a search. So 6 p.m. P-I. There it is. It's in the code right there. So that's cool. So now we can press verify on that one. And there we go. Ownership verified. Job done. So now we've got a little tiny bit of traffic. Is there any performance data? Yep, there is some data already. Uh, sometimes it can say wait 48 hours. And that's just because nobody's ever been connected before. But it looks like this guy already has it connected. So this is a confirmation that uh, Google can share private information with you about your website. And that's why they go through this process. And uh, it's definitely worth doing. So there we go.